So I've noticed a lot of questions about my Vegas VIP points, and I think today's just the day for me to try to explain. Is the Ace of Vegas, the Ace of Vegas. So my Vegas VIP points are a fairly new concept. They originated in the mobile games and worked their way into the main game. They're very important as they affect your chip replenishment, your chip package purchases, and even your level of support. Depending on how many you have, you achieve different levels in the game that give you special VIP perks. Think of it as a loyalty card within the game. Not quite the same as an actual MLife card, but the same general concept and all you need to do is play and you'll get more. So to get the most out of your VIPs you need to play the PC version of My Vegas Slots, My Vegas Slots Mobile on your cellular device, and My Konami Slots on your mobile phone or tablet. There are three ways to earn VIP points. You earn them from your daily spins that you normally get when you log in anyway. These, as you know, occur once every 24 hours. The second place you earn VIP points is from hourly bonuses. These are exclusive to the My Vegas mobile game and My Konami slots. The third way to earn them is to purchase chips in the store. Now that you've earned a few VIP points, let's explain what they do. You start at Turquoise, the lowest level you can get by earning 10 MVPs. Basically, as soon as you log in, you're Turquoise. Your benefits for this level never expire, and as you gather daily bonuses as well as your hourly bonuses, you'll collect 10% more chips than you normally would. Amethyst is an easy one. Once you've collected 75 MVPs, you'll jump up a level. You then have 7 days to earn either 75 MVPs to stay at Amethyst or earn 300 to advance to Opal. At Amethyst, you get a 20% bonus on hourly and daily bonuses, and if you choose to purchase chips, you will get an additional 10% boost. Opal is pretty much the same as Amethyst once you've earned 300 points. You get 15 days to maintain or surpass Opal. For your diligence, your bonuses will be a full 30% on hourly and daily bonuses, and chip purchases will get an additional 25%. Emerald is likely where you'll fall if you play for free. Your Emerald benefits last 30 days and earn you a 50% bonus on all daily spins, hourly collections, and chip packages. Sapphire is when things start to get good. Play under this level for 45 days with a 75% bonus to all daily, hourly, and purchase bonuses. You'll also gain access to the My Vegas High Roller Room to play some higher end or exclusive games. Ruby is probably the greatest level that you'll get to with a low purchase price. 150% on all bonuses and 100% on chip packages with the same high roller access with a full 60 days to enjoy the benefits. You'll need a bank breaking 14,000 points to make it here. The top of the lane is Tanzanite. 33,000 MVPs get you a whopping 250% bonus on chip collection and 150% on chip purchases for the next 90 days. You attain priority support and earn the fabled My Vegas VIP host. Much like a real casino host, they allegedly reward your loyalty with all sorts of perks, like purchases of unclaimable gifts, even sold out ones in the store. Now the real question is, how far can you go? Well, we've worked out a foolproof formula using math. Assuming you play every day and you get your maximum daily spin multiplier, this is how many VIP points you can earn in a day. Doing your daily spin on each game will earn you 30 MVPs. 30 MVPs times 3 games earns 90, meaning it'll only take a single spin to get you past Amethyst. In addition, the hourly bonuses will earn you 5 MVPs per collection. 5 points times 2 games, My Konami and My Vegas, is 10 points per collection. Assuming you play for about 12 hours a day, that's 60 points a day. Take the 90 points and add it to your 60, you're up to 150 points a day on average, meaning you can easily earn a 1400 point emerald membership in 10 days. And the sapphire in 30 days is nothing. The only problem is, we realized you only get 45 days to get to ruby. Now we calculated that if you collected all bonuses over 24 hours, yes we're assuming you're somehow staying awake 24 hours a day or alternatively only waking up every two hours to collect these bonuses. 12 bonus collections over two games equals 24 bonus collections, times five points per collection equals 120 points a day, plus the 90 points you get for your daily VIP spins, bringing you to a sum total of 210. 210 times 45 days means the maximum VIP that you can earn for free is... 9,450 my VIP points. And the game requires 14,000 my VIP points to make it to Ruby. Tanzanite is even more insane because you're required to get a game breaking 33,000 my VIPs. Meaning, even with perfect play, the most you can ever earn for free is 12,600 my VIP points. So, what if you want Ruby tier benefits? Well, in addition to playing perfectly and getting every bonus over the 24 hour period, you'll need to 
to invest about $115 in chip packages from the store, assuming each bonus bundle grants you 40 my VIP points for every dollar spent, which it usually does. By that point, you'll have swept up something like half a billion paid chips for yourself, which on the bright side does get you some better rewards. But if you're a free-to-play player and intend to keep it that way, then you can't get these big bonuses. Tanzanite is the worst of it. Bare minimum, assuming you hit Ruby and stay awake 24 hours a day for the 60-day period, you'll need to collect every daily and hourly bonus in addition to spending upwards of $510 in chips within those same 60 days. After spending the $115 to reach Ruby those other 45 days while staying awake 24 hours a day. So if you want the most important My Vegas VIP experience, you'll have to shell out some cash. Maybe even twice what we quoted a moment ago, because I sincerely doubt you'll be awake 24-7 for the next 105 days straight. But Honestly, are you surprised? Play Studios is still running a business, and it's completely optional. Either way, now you know what you need to do to get the most out of your My Vegas experience. That's all the time we have today, Spinners and Sharks. I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, I'd appreciate a like, and if you'd like to check out any past or future tutorials, then feel free to hit that subscribe button. We'll see you next time, and as always, strong hands and happy spinning.